Hello guys, Keeper on TV here, back for yet another match preview. In today's preview, I'm going to be previewing the game being played this Saturday, Bournemouth versus Birmingham City. So let's get straight into the preview. We're going to be starting off with Bournemouth first. Of course, Bournemouth sat their manager, Tyndall, after a run of five games without a win. Lost four and drew one in their last five championship games, including a 2-1 defeat at home to Sheffield Wednesday in midweek. So they're going to be looking to bounce back. They're without a manager. To be honest, I mean they could still probably beat us without a manager. They've got, they'll probably have their assistant manager, um, in charge of the game this Saturday. They currently sit sixth in the championship, so they're still in the playoffs. Um, but I think he, I think Tindall was sacked due to the fact that um there was nowhere near the top two. Um, so yeah, their top goal scorer is Dominic Solanke with ten goals. Uh, and of course they beat us three one at St Andrews earlier on in the season. Getting on to Birmingham. We had that awful, awful draw away to Wickham. And Rotherham beat Derby 3-0 um, last night. So now we are two points above the drop. Rotherham have two games in hand on us. Sheffield Wednesday, their next two games are Millwall and Wickham. I can see them getting at least four points from their two games. Where are, where are we getting our points from? But yeah, the, the starting eleven. I would start a 4-4-2, you know. Neil Everidge in goal, Mikel San Jose... Not playing as a centre back. I don't know why. Mikas and Jose and Ivan uh, Sunic in the middle. Sorry, I don't know why I started off with the middle first. Harley Dean and Mark. Well, oh, Mark Roberts can't play. <laughs> Mark Roberts can't. Maybe uh, Clark Salter and Harley Dean at the back. Left back Pedersen. Right back Colin. The two midfield. Yeah, I've already gone through them, haven't I? Um, Sanchez Bella Eva Wings. Actually, no. I I would drop. I would actually drop Ivan Sunic and put in Kareem Harper. You know. Um, so, Cream Harper and Mikhail Sanose in the middle. And up top, Sam Crosgrove and Scott Hogan. I think if we play Yukovic and Crosgrove together, I don't think it will work. You know, big man, little man partnership, Scott Hogan and Sam Crosgrove. Um, so he's got to start. We've got to start Kareem Harper. We've got to start Scott um, Crosgrove as well. Because, uh, yeah, I don't want to be seeing them on the bench. Oh, yeah. Our new our new right back we signed. A complete, yeah, is it Jan... Valerie, something like that. Yeah, he, he. I don't think he'll be starting this. I don't. I don't think I would start him in this game. Yeah, he's a brilliant player, but yeah, um, I would start Max and Colin, even though he did miss that chance against Wickham. But this is a game where we we're coming into this game massive and we're we're massive underdogs, even though Bournemouth have been on a, on a truly awful run. They will still they'll be looking at this game thinking we can get three points. Do you know? kickstart our season and try and get that top two place. It's going to be a loss, isn't it? Another loss. I'm going to go with a 2-1. I do think we'll score. I don't know why, but it's just it's just going to be the most blues thing, isn't it, to win this game? So I'm going to go with a 2-1 Bournemouth defeat, but knowing that that we could... Well, on, on current form of... I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. They've got better players than us. They should be winning the game, even though their run is awful. But we have proved it. Middlesbrough away, Reading away, Bristol City away. We can go to teams that are top half of the table and get a result. But yeah, um, we could see ourselves in the bottom three come the end of the weekend. <laughs> in the bottom three, can you believe it? Wow. Let's hope that other teams below us drop points. But that's 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 what we've become now we're relying on other teams to drop points so we're not in the bottom three we're in 21st place it's just yeah it's just really bleak isn't it being a blues supporter and um yeah 2-1 Bournemouth as I said make sure to like share and also subscribe to the channel leave your predictions down below in the comments it's been keep on to I, I think I've already yeah anyway see you later keep on